Hello friends, I'm just going to do a fast, quick junk journal doodle um, speak over thingy today. I thought I'd do it really fast, see how this works for you guys. I'm using an envelope in my junk journal, pulling apart some coloring books pages and cutting them out. I did this um, with Nikki Parr on our channel as well and I'm going to do a few more just continuing with this little junky journal painting doodle thing. So I kind of just paint over it and made uh, a little doodle street face type thing I could and yeah I was just having fun with it. Cutting these circles out of a coloring book and then the other one was a all these cities in the world coloring book kind of thing. I don't know where I got them from. Some of them might have been the dollar store. Some of them might have just been bargain shops gifts, that kind of thing, and I thought I would like to use them in a different way in a junk journal. So I started gluing the the spheres in the center, have my city on the outskirts kind of a thing, and um, just totally play with it. I mod podge these down, or decolopodge them down, and um, really wasn't careful. I was just kind of playing around and really relaxing. This really helped me relax today. So I love the cityscape and then the shapes in the center. I added some color after this, um, and I can't even remember, I think it was, <laughs> I'll have to wait till I get there. Um, I wasn't sure I was going to use this video. Um, the picture, I don't have a picture at the end because I accidentally closed my book and I tore the picture, so I'll have to repurpose that picture. Oh yeah, I used my um, uh, Tattered Angels, blue and red, that's right on there. And I don't even think I let the glue dry too much and I just added that little the opposite uh, sky red rather than blue and and then I added some gesso on top of that just to lighten it up. I'm playing and having fun so at this point it doesn't really matter to me. I'm just trying to enjoy it and uh, play with it. Relax this morning when I was doing that. Filling my pages and that kind of thing, and uh, just doodling. Um, it wasn't like a masterpiece painting that I did. I was just total doodling, but uh, I had fun with it. They don't all have to be um, masterpieces or whatnot, you know. They can just be fun. Hey, the puppies are growling. Sorry, guys. <laughs> hey, they're being so mean. So I just kind of get a little forehead and nose happening, and I kind of blocked out with gesso first and then went in with it. It was just play. It was just a different way to paint to see how it worked and that kind of thing. And uh, yeah, played with it like that. So that's my gesso in there. Making some cheeks, fe facial features, eye-ish areas, and mouth areas, chin, ears. Played with really unique colors. I wanted to stick, I think, with the blue and reds on here and make the purples maybe a bit with that and just play with it. That's all I wanted to do, just uh, keep with those colors and have fun with that. So just started to um, make the features just a bit. Like I said, very playful, nothing um, fantabulous kind of thing, but just a playful time. They don't, like I said, relax. It's like a diary. You, you write little notes or you write little dreams and journals exactly the same thing. You just journal however you're feeling at that moment. And um, this particular one's out in the public, but when you do yours, you don't have to share it. You can just do whatever you want. Um, but I mean, I don't mind sharing. If you guys like it, you like it. If you don't, well, I liked it. It was okay. <laughs> it was fun. Mostly, it was relaxing. So I just keep working it and playing with it until I get a tone that I like, and I'm mixing the red and blues, going back and forth, and not really thinking about anything, just being very primitive with it like a child just having fun with it making the big earrings um, I just thought oh well, I'm going to do those big uh, big earrings big piercings in there and I thought I'd add that and I thought that was pretty cool and uh, yeah that's about it just fun doodling kind of a thing so yeah adding the more blues in the back and I kinda like that there's just a s little punch of the city coming through uh, of course my my spheres in the middle are not showing but I know they're there and I had fun gluing them and that was that's really the most important part and then I thought I'd be really nerdy and paint some nerdy glasses and I think you think I know what they look like <laughs> but I had fun I was trying to make them a little bit I think I made them too round I should have made them square but hey 
but please don't close your book. I let it dry for a little while, and then I worked on another page, closed my book without putting something in the center. So that page is going to be refurbished. <laughs> but I doodled on with some of my um, pencil here, and this is like an all graphite pencil. It's not a water soluble one or anything. It's just something I can see. I doodled some loop de loos or whatever you call them, and then painted white and looped over what I doodled in black, and just had fun with that. Kind of like a graffiti page, really. And that's about it, friends. I hope you like it and had fun watching my doodle page. Bye. <laughs> oh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to craft like a duck.